Cubex. 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 The goals of the cubic system is really to be able to reduce a lot of the manual processes associated with supply management within a hospital. So for example, one of the things that we do is the system automatically keeps track of the inventory levels, freeing up an individual to have to go around the hospital to actually do an inventory, then get on the phone with a vendor and place that order. In this case, the system does it automatically for them. There's a lot of blame on the inventory person if things aren't going well. It is important to every person in this hospital uh, from receptionist to kennel because it, if you don't have what they need, they can't do their job. One of the biggest things since we've implemented this is that we're more organized. Uh, we don't have to write down on a little pad that sometimes get lost. I'd come into work about over a weekend and there'd be six, seven, eight notes on my desk. We're out of this. We're out of that. Where is this? Where is that? And I don't get them anymore. Uh, the Cubex allows for a much tighter control of the product because you know exactly where it is. Remember the Fortune 500 companies like Walmart, they're really focused on having just-in-time inventory, meaning that they only have the inventory on hand that they absolutely need. In order to do that, they have very sophisticated systems that allow them to manage the data around the inventory. Our web-based software will actually automatically email them reporting on consumption, on aging of items, so items that aren't being used. Um, on staff members, compliance levels, and so they all they have to do is open up an email and look at a report. I really like the reports because it gives you an idea of what's going on. And the aging report tells you, you've kept something in your cupboard for six months that you haven't used. Why are you not using it? Do you really need it? Or can you use something else just as good in that place? And I think that's, that's a, a real plus for us. The key benefits we see are really fall into three key categories. One is the labor associated with managing supplies drastically gets reduced through our system because we automate the supply management process. The other thing is we reduce the amount of inventory that's typically utilized within a facility, not only from a storage standpoint but also from a consumption standpoint. They now can see what their consumption is on you know, a monthly, quarterly, daily basis. And so they see um, what type of products they're going through. They can see where they can actually come in and consolidate different types of products now that they've got data. One of the other reports that it generates, it generates the 10 items most used in the practice. And then it tells you what you've actually spent on those products and that way you can maybe negotiate with the vendor for a better price. Say, look, this is how much I get for a month, what about a year, what about giving me a better price? And that's another way where this cabinet can actually make money for you, not just save. And I look at it, it doesn't just save money, it makes money for a practice. The um, return on investment or ROI as we refer to it is fairly quick. And the facilities that we're installing, we're seeing a less than a 12-month payback in the veterinary market. As the owner of the practice, I've never taken an interest to the extent I do now in the drug inventory con control system because I know how easy it is to do for us now and, and how well it's working. Learning your use at Cubex was very simple. Um, you don't have to be very computer savvy to navigate around what you need to do in order to input your supplies into the computer nor into the Cubex. Um, it's a little bit of organization and that's really it. So the basics are that I'd walk up to the cabinet, I punch in my ID, and then I punch in my password. And then based on who I am, different doors will open for different access levels that I may have within the system. Now if I'm a manager, I have full access to the system and if I need an item, I can either do the search function where I look for the item, I can hit the first letter of the item, select that item and then it'll actually guide me to where that item is or I can simply just open up the door if I know where the item is, find the item I'm looking for, I push the button and then what that does it actually decrements the inventory out of the system, I take the item, close the door and I exit out of the system and that's the end of that transaction. What happens is the system keeps track of all this data and then it forwards it electronically back to something we call MyCubix. And the MyCubix is a web-hosted database and application that keeps track of all the min-max levels in the cabinet. And when this item, along with the other items in the cabinet, hit its min, it'll automatically reorder those items from the designated supplier of those items. We would order once a month. And, in the, and when you order once a month for this size hospital, 
massive amounts of stuff would come in and so it would take her a couple of days to put it all away to where now we're ordering once a week and typically a big a large order should take about two hours to put away so you can use a person that previously was mainly just responsible for the supplies you can free up to do other work maybe phone clients generate more income uh, help with the reminders up front at the front office staff so that person is freed up to do other jobs instead of just checking on the inventory all the time. With the current economic conditions that we're in, it's becoming very important to drive efficiencies within their office, but they don't have the tools to manage it. But now with Cubix here, they will have the tools. I just feel one of the worst things that can happen to me now is to practice without this. You know, I've got to, it's like going back to an ox wagon. You know, I've got to start doing all that stuff again. <laughs> to go back to the old way would be very difficult to do. You're gonna be like, oh, you want me to do that? <laughs> I don't think so. What I'm hearing people say is, you know, I used to really think about inventory or worry about are we going to run out, did I place that order. Now with Cubix, I don't think about inventory anymore. And that's exactly what we want to hear. We want them to hear that they've kind of forgotten about supply management, inventory management, and that the Cubix takes care of it for them.